energy tech inside. While Tesla, Ford, and GM all, very publicly, be for the top spot in the American electric vehicle market, Hyundai has quietly built a powerhouse lineup of EVs that threatens to surpass them all. The Ioniq 6, like the other iterations of the Ioniq lineup, is built atop Hyundai's eGMP platform. As such, the 6 is outfitted with an industry-leading 800V electrical architecture enabling a 10 to 80 charge in just 18 minutes. It will be available with either a standard 55 kilowatt hour battery pack or an optional 77.4 kilowatt hour pack, equivalent to what the Kia EV6 and Polestar 2 offer. Combined with a minuscule 0.21 drag coefficient, which is also one of the best on the market, the Ionic 6 is expected to top 610 kilometers on a single charge. And like the Ionic 5, the 6 also offers V2L capabilities, enabling it to charge your house, accessories, and even other vehicles. Its exceedingly aerodynamic exterior, available in a dozen different colors, has been likened to that of an Apple mouse come to life, like someone shortened the back of Mercedes-Benz' ambitious AVTR concept and gave it a duck lip. An optional 20-inch rims. Drivers will have the option between RWD and AWD, 2, and 4 motor, variants. Per Hyundai, the AWD will output 239 kilowatts, 320 HP, with 605 newton meters of torque and hit 60 from a standstill in 5.1 seconds. You'll have to opt for the small battery RWD model to achieve maximum efficiency and get the sub 14 kilowatt hour slash 100 km WLTP estimated energy consumption. Drivers will be able to tightly customize their preferred driving experience using the Ionic SXS EV performance tune-up system. Dial in everything from steering effort and motor power to accelerator pedal sensitivity and driveline mode. You can also group various aspect settings into quick selectable packages, like a loadout in Call of Duty, or focus modes in iOS. Pricing has yet to be announced for the Ionic 6, though production is slated to begin in Q3 2022. Stay tuned, Hyundai will make the Ionic SXS official American introduction in November. Energy Tech Inside